Low cell transmitter often refers to a device that converts the low cell signal into an analog or digital output, and the digital outputs are useful in more advanced wing applications. The low cell transmitter is typically used to connect a low cell to a computer, PLC, or process control system. Here we have a low cell transmitter model 510 offered by ATO. Our transmitter adopts aluminum alloy housing and is C certified. The internal high-performance device is used to accurately amplify the sensor output signal. Waterproof enclosure alongside high-precision circuits used makes its output more stable and accurate. The signal conditioning weight transmitter is designed for use with low cells, strain gauges, and microvolt input signals where exceptional sensitivity and stability are required. It is a high-performance instrument designed to connect directly single or four low cells. Connections are made on the side of the weight transmitter. It can be powered from 18 to 30 volt DC supplies and can provide excitation voltage needed by the attached transformer. The excitation voltage can be selected between 5 and 15 volt DC. This high precision weight transmitter can accept a 0 to 20 millivolt full scale input range and convert the low strength signal into four ranges of analog output. Scale operators find the analog output signal particularly useful for monitoring hopper filling and discharge. Featuring high precision, high sensitivity, high stability, and durability in use, the transmitter is also equipped with external zero adjustment of standard signal, external gain adjustment, linear compensation, humidity compensation, input overload protection, output short circuit protection, and many more impressive functions. The DY510 low cell transmitter is ideal for basic weighing systems as well as industrial applications. ATO offers a wide selection of low-cell amplifiers and low-cell transmitters. These amplifiers are typically powered from DC supplies. Our low-cell amplifier selection has outputs ranging from analog to digital outputs.